The first matchup of the week is the Cardinals versus Texans. Cardinals coming off of a close loss to the Seahawks, 22-16. Texans got blown out by the Rams. I think the Cardinals can win this one. Drew Stanton had a touchdown in around 200 yards last game. I think they can win this one in a pretty close game. Lions versus Bears. Bears defense, I think, is going to be able to hold the Lions offense to relatively low scoring. Uh, I think this is going to be a low scoring game, but I think the Lions can win this one. Uh, it's going to be a close game. I, I don't think I don't see either uh, offenses being able to put up a lot of points, but I do see the Lions winning. Ravens versus Packers. Uh, Ravens have been pretty inconsistent this year, but the Packers without Aaron Rodgers have not been the same. They just got their first win without him. I think the Ravens can win this one. Uh, Brett Hundley has not been playing too too great at all. Uh, Browns, Browns versus Jaguars. With the 49ers getting their first win, that puts the Browns with the worst record in the NFL. Jaguars coming off of a win uh, over the Chargers, 20-17. to I think the Chargers can win this one in a lopsided game. Uh, Rams versus Vikings. I think this is going to be the game of the week. Uh, the Rams coming off of a win over the Texans in a blowout, 33-7. Vikings coming off of another win over the Redskins, 38-30. But I do see the Rams winning this one. It could go either way, though. Next game is the Redskins versus Saints. Redskins, like I said, coming off of a loss to the Vikings. And the Saints on a seven-game winning streak. And I think they continue that streak to eight. Uh, I, I definitely see this see them winning their uh, this game against the Redskins. QB play has been great. Uh, Defense is playing pretty well. Uh, Chiefs versus Giants. Giants just lost to the 0-9 uh, 49ers. And I think the Chiefs can win this one. The Chiefs have fallen off a little bit with back-to-back -back losses. Uh, but I do see them beating the Giants in this one in a pretty lopsided game. Buccaneers versus Dolphins. Buccaneers coming off of a win over the Jets, 15-10. to And the Dolphins are uh, playing right now as I'm recording this against the Panthers. Uh, but I definitely I do see the Dolphins being able to win this one. It could go either way, but I'm definitely picking with the Dolphins. Bills versus Chargers. Chargers coming off of a really close game to the Jaguars. Uh, Bills coming off of a, a loss. Uh, I see the Chargers being able to win this one. The Bills got blown out by the Saints, 47-10. Bengals versus Broncos. Broncos got blown out by the uh, Patriots, 41-16. And the Bengals had a very close game against the uh Titans, I think the Bron Broncos bounce back, and I think they can uh, hold Andy Dalton with that defense uh, down to low scoring. Patriots versus Raiders, this is going to be another fantastic game. Uh, Patriots, you know, like I said, blow out the uh, Broncos. I th see them winning. Now, th as for the Raiders, this is a must-win game uh, be if, you, if they want to get in the playoffs. Uh, next game, Eagles versus Cowboys. I think this is also going to be a really great game, but the Eagles, they have been playing fantastic. Best, best record in the NFL. I definitely see them winning this game, especially with the Cowboys not having Ezekiel Elliott. see them winning this game. Falcons versus Seahawks. This is going to be a very close game. Uh, again, a lot of good matchups this week, but the Falcons, I think, can upset the Seahawks. Falcons coming off of a uh, pretty big win over the Cowboys 27-7. I see them winning that game.